Hello my darling! Welcome to my channel. I'm your favorite Dr. Sita today again with a new pick up I'll reading my baby. You already know today's topic, new love on the horizon. Who is coming towards you to give you a love offer? Singles, now it's time for you to know who is coming next and exactly new love offer. Okay, who is coming towards you to give you love offer? Baby, whatever you're manifesting. If you're manifesting your future spouse with your husband, future wife, boyfriend, girlfriend, whoever. What's coming next for you? Okay, let's go find out. So my baby, if you're new to my channel, have the idea of what's going on. Let me tell you, I am an intuitive tarot reader. And I use my intuition and magical power to channel messages from angels and universe to guide you guys. It's purely intuitive with reading. So trust your intuition and trust your gut feelings in order to choose the perfect group for yourself. Okay? My group number one, my, okay, let's check my group number two and my, um, okay, this one, group number three. So, my darling, I'm going to give you the beautiful closure. Look where you can choose one of the group for yourself, group one, group two, and group three. And definitely, you already know this is purely intuitive best reading. So trust your gut feelings and choose the group whichever you are drawn to. And if you are drawn to more about one group, feel free to choose this group as well. Maybe you got some extra messages from angels and the universe. I hope my darling you choose the perfect group for yourself i'll get the timestamps in the description box go there click on the timestamps and the video will give you the exact timing when your pile is going to be started my darling if you're not into my soul tribe go ahead subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon for a new update because i put every day my darling so let's go jump into your magical reading my darling, my amazing group number one, welcome, welcome to your magical reading. So you choose this beautiful card, the tip that is the message from your counterpart, okay? Whatever your lover is telling you, okay? So yeah, transformation, your relationship with one another is about to deepen. Love conquers and transforms all things. Yes, group number one. So you know, this, the type of relationship you are going to have with your person or whoever is coming to give you the love offer is going to transform your life it's going to change your life you're not going to live the same life as before group number one your life is about to change 180 degree after you meet this person after you start having this amazing relationship with them let's see um i'm also picking up my group number one the first time you're going to meet this person you know whoever entering in your life next to give you love offer like they are not going to seem like your type okay so first time you might want to step back and see that what's going on because this person is not your type or they're not going to show themselves the way you wanted them to um show themselves the way you expected them to show themselves they're not going to show themselves that way but underneath exactly this person is the one that you have been manifesting so group number one you know the typical message for you is like gift in disguise or unexpectedly you're going to meet the right person either in the right time but you're not going to see them the way you wanted them to see because they are going to be a bit of surprise like the unpuzzled box or lots of surprises are coming here for you so let's go find out to my group number one what kind of new love is coming towards you if you're looking for new love if you're looking for that whatever is coming towards you next the lover then this is the perfect reading for you my group number one and definitely if you're not into my soul tribe go ahead subscribe to my channel hit that bell icon for new update because if you become one of my family member one of my soul tribe it becomes a lot easier for me okay maybe whatever there is for you okay Three guides to my guardian angel, Archangel Michael Maharso, Chan message to me for my group number one. Who's coming to give you a love offer? Who is coming to give you a love offer? I'm going to pull three cards from here, okay? From this deck. Who is coming towards you to give you a love offer? 
who is coming towards you to give you a love offer my beautiful group number one who is coming towards you to give you a love offer let's go find out so oh my god two of cups <laughs> this is your soulmate my group number one who is coming towards you to give you a love offer this is your soulmate this is your twin flame somebody that you're going to have long-term relationship with this is your potential husband or potential wife my darling okay whoever you're watching for your partner your divine counterpart this is the person you have been waiting for this is the answer to your manifestation somebody who is going to vibe the way you vibe both of your vibrations will be same this is exactly your soulmate both of you are similar and group number one how will you know you have made this person because though this person doesn't show themselves at the first time um that's why you are going to be a little bit of confused that oh my god is this the person i've been waiting for but after a few weeks like one or two or three weeks you will know like within a month you will know that this is your person because i am picking up somehow you just don't know why you feel so much drawn to them why you feel so much connected to them uh, that's the vibe I'm picking up. That's how you will know that this is your person because you don't know why you feel like you know them or why you feel like that uh, this is the person for you. With the two of cups, both of you got the similar idea, similar view, similar perspective, and lots of similarities are here. With the two of cups, this is your potential husband or potential wife. So I just want to take one card to get that uh when will you meet this person my group number one okay when will you meet this potential soulmate okay group number one when will you meet this potential soulmate this person could be pisces cancer scorpio or leo because i can see the lion here and also i'm picking up you and your person both of you are like both of your choices are same both of you could have the same zodiac sunshine moonshine or same birthday or something okay or same birth month same zodiac lots of similarities are here okay so let's go get one card to find out my group number one when will you meet your beautiful soulmate that the reading is all about when will you meet them so i'm going to take the card a moment later but let me get these two cards first so who is coming towards you to give you love offer um oh my god ten of pentacle oh my god oh my god jesus my lord krishna what is it here <laughs> oh baby look at that two of cups so many ten of pentacle it talks about the family it talks about family it talks about building a family someone who wants to build a long-term committed connection with you someone who is financially stable materially stable someone who is loyal committed faithful to you someone who just respect you value you and both of you got amazing kind of understanding understanding is amazing mental adjustment is amazing you know what they want they know what you want both of you got that intuitive telepathic relationship that's that's amazing ten of pentacle it's like totally committed and loyal connection lots of loyalty and commitment is here in my group number one okay and the six of one success victorious champion a leader um wow a famous person who is a public figure your person is someone that they're doing something out there that people love them and your person is the captain or the other team leader they're at the boss people work under your future spouse they are really doing something like they are in the, in the lead into the leading position and by looking at the ten of pentacles and six of wands your person is a business person businessman or business woman they are not into government jobs because your person loves to do things with their own way with free will no kind of rules are they are controlling them because horace talks about freedom independence where they can do whatever they feel like uh, right things to do to them or to their company uh okay somebody who is having oh my god lots of success in their life this is a successful person and whoever is entering in their life they're extremely open for marriage they are going to give you the marriage proposal they're going to tell you or ask you out 
or oh my god this is all about money luxuries commitment stability family home i can see babies i can see both of you are happy soulmate meeting each other uh, at the end of the day this is the vibe i'm picking up so let's take a look or a hint that when will you probably meet this person the queen of wands well um the queen of wands is kind of give me the spring energy so you're going to meet your person in the spring or let's say when the summer is ending and the winter is coming or when the winter is ending and the summer is coming this is a transition point you're going to meet this person there will be lots of flowers that really bloom in your area also the cat is kind of tell me that it is going to be your um you know okay okay you know what i'm picking up with the queen of wands you're going to meet your person in the month of october november or the month of april may october november april may this is the month that i'm picking up but it's going to be a very sunny day with the sunflower the day will be sunny warm and beautiful and this card also shows your position in your life and queen of wands you are successful you are positive you are leading a very happy optimistic life you are leading a life with full of glory happiness and there is no obstacle and sadness in your life you are not feeling sad or gloomy anymore this is also a sign that when will you meet your person when you are very happy you are in a very happy state to my group number one the moment you're going to meet your person so this is the vibe i'm picking up so if you feel stuck right now if you feel like that you're going to lots of you're going to lots of things that is really unsolved right now or unresolved then everything will be resolving the moment you're going to meet them but definitely there will be a, a high point or you are exactly in your best version you're feeling very happy very happy and very optimistic the queen of wands you're on your throne like you are at the stage where you don't even care what other people think about you anymore you don't even care that what others talks about you anymore you're just leading your happy and best life now let's go find out whoever is entering in your life something about their personality i'm going to pick three cards from here to understand your uh, person's personality okay whoever is entering in your life their personality okay let's go find out their personality um okay seven of wands they are going to be possessive protective and territorial they are going to protect you and set a healthy boundary where no negative energies can come and ruin this relationship this person is a private person and knows how to deal with private things so group number one this person is someone they are going to be protective of you and you're going to feel extremely safe with them so if you tell them a secret they are not going to tell anybody else this person can take any secret to the grave they got this um reliability in themselves that i'm picking up okay also this person is going to be a fighter and a warrior for you so this person will always fight for you always your supporter no matter what and you got the five of wands they are playful and with lots of fire energy your person could have the fire energy in them aries leo sagittarius this person like sun moon are rising or their very prominent energy is fire this person is extremely fiery and you know the fiery energy talks about what courageous happy confident successful a uh, quick learner quick decision maker uh, very much active and passionate follow their dreams and fire energy people these people can't be tamed okay it depends on their choice that if they want to be with you or not this your future spouse or the person who is coming towards you to offer you love connection they can't be manipulated by others or not even you this person can't be manipulated by other people because your person is like yeah they they do whatever they feel like with the five of wands they are playful enjoyable and they will crack jokes to you this person is somebody no matter how tension or no matter how problems are there in their life this person always knows how to solve everything and how to cut the 
root cause of the problem so that you guys can have the happy life this person is always into solution rather than um, consulting the same problem again and again this person really wants to conclude all the negative things that was really not helping you guys to become the best version of yourself so uh yes queen of pentacle you know i love the vibe queen of pentacle you are the queen of wands your person is the queen of pentacle this person is motherly okay this is one of their vibes this person is motherly this person is um charitable motherly give you gift and extremely nurturing and nourishing and this person is somebody they love to give you nourishment they love to take care of you this person is a very caring person you you are oh my god this person is caring this person is loving and you're about to receive lots of care from them this person loves to care for you truly genuinely they care for you okay so you know the vibe like when you are not at your good shape this person is always there for you and with the queen of pentacles they are loyal okay they're hella loyal i'm picking up also with the five of wands energy <laughs> your person is somebody they are highly competitive okay they're highly competitive so let's go find out that how this person will treat you in the future okay Whoever the new person entering in your life, how this person will treat you. How this person will treat you in this relationship, my beautiful group number one. How this person is going to treat you. So I'm going to take three cards for that. How this person is going to treat you. Okay, eight of air, self-doubt, confusion, and free will. Now, this card really shows that at the moment you feel indecisive, don't know what to do, you feel like you're blocked, you are like in a position you can't move or you can't feel your own emotion, this person is always there as your rescuer. This person is going to open your eyes where you can see nothing can stop you. There is no blockages. It's all in your mind. So group number one, you are generally an overthinker. You think a lot. Sometimes you think too much that you don't even know when to start and when to stop. So if you're an overthinker and watching my video, this person is here to ease your mind, to give you the real view that what, what is there out there, okay? Okay, eight of art. You know, the eight, number eight is coming so strongly. So education, focus, details. This person, oh my God, this person is going to help you to get your goal, your achievements, whatever you want, your dreams. Your person is your supporter, your helper, and even your career, my group number one, whatever your career is, okay, whatever your hobby is, that is going to flourish after marriage. With the aid of art talks about that, maybe you want to learn something, or maybe you're learning and don't know how to implement that knowledge, that skill in everyday life your person is going to show you the path so your career your life will change dramatically after marriage and this person is going to show you where to put your hard work there you can see your reward perfectly okay and your person is somebody i'm picking up they are going to put you out there to the world where other people can see that who you truly are this person is not going to cage you and ten of earth, wow. And my darling, ten of earth is coming twice here and here. Ten of pentacle. So it talks about prosperity, security, tradition. Your person is going to be an orthodox person, and they are believer of marriage, family, loyalty, commitment, money, stability and obeying you respect you this person is going to be your golden retriever boyfriend or girlfriend or husband or wife this person is going to be sweet rich successful they respect you they obey you they listen to you they are faithful and they're going to support you in your career in your everyday life in your skill this person is hella loyal they are extremely loyal and committed this person wants to have a marriage with you so group number one if you want a boyfriend for temporary reason this is not your group because group number one whoever is entering in your life 
they want to be with you they want they, they want to be with you for a lifetime this person wants to be your life partner this person wants you to be with them for their entire life ten of earth talks about commitment family babies coming together it's a fruitful fruitful um investment emotionally this is what i'm picking up this person is going to treat you so right okay and you deserve them you deserve them and they deserve you too okay communication both of your communication will be amazing both of you will be having like deep talking deep communication deep conversation wow that's beautiful and with this tortoise it really again talks about dependable energy like slow as slow and steady wins the race commitment stability this person is going to stay with you forever and ever be spontaneous your person i told you they will have some fire energy in them they are spontaneous and this person will enter in your life with the energy of love and commitment and they're going to sweep you off your feet. They are giving you a romantic proposal that you can deny. Because you can see the seriousness and sincerity in their eyes. That's beautiful, my group number one. I'm so happy for you. Congratulations, my baby. So that's all I got for you. Give it a thumbs up. Also, my darling, subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell icon if you're not into my family. I love you so much. Till then, stay happy and blessed. I love you so much. Hey, my darling, my amazing group number two. Welcome, welcome to Magical Reading. This is your perfect card that you choose. Look at that. You know, this card really looks like an angel. Your person is going to be an earth angel. The angelic, the love can you see the love heart here and the wings and the rose cords here so you're going to marry an art angel they're going to love you protect you and they're going to be your baby okay i'm picking up this person he's really going to be your baby okay so the card shows acceptance is the key to inner peace at times we must accept things as they are there is no point trying to change that which is beyond our control that's so true baby you can't change something that is untangible right so the vibe i'm picking up that your person they're going to love you they're going to respect you because you are somebody you are full of acceptance you accept the way they are you are not going to uh, change them you are not going to make them feel inferior or you're not going to make them feel bad about who they are or whatever they have done in their past you're not going to judge them you're not judgmental you accept people the way they are and you believe that if they have done something wrong maybe there was a reason for it okay that's the vibe i'm picking up my group number two that's beautiful wow so here is the thing my group number two when it comes to your relationship your person is going to be extremely patient towards you they are going to be patient and this person is going to be calm and cool and they are not hot-headed no this person is not hot-headed this person is cool and calm and try to understand you even in the moment when you are mad at them this person will never ever raise their voice against you because it is their it is their ethics it is their um it is the rule in your mind that I can't hurt my partner no matter what. Okay, so this is the vibe I'm picking up. So, yeah. Your person is literally the love angel. Okay. Group number two, you're very lucky. This person is going to be emotionally so much invested in you. So much. Okay, you know this person will tell you that whatever I have, that is all for you. Are extremely romantic and you know what the best thing this person is going to be balanced they are not instable when it comes to their romantic affairs so let's go find out my group number two who's coming towards you to offer you love who's coming towards you to offer you love my beautiful group number two who's coming towards you to offer you love who's coming towards you to offer you love i'm going to pick three cards for you my darling and who's coming towards you to offer you love let's go find out nine of pentacle wow 
someone who is free spirited independent to reach successful and this person is a freelancer businessman or businesswoman this person is right now single it's a big sign my group number two that your person whoever coming towards you to give you love offer they are single right now they are not in a relationship this person believes that whoever they encounter with their energy also influence their life so this person is not going to invest their emotional side or their love or they're not going to show their sacred body to anybody okay they're they're like a reserving one this person is really reserving themselves for you this person really got that vibe okay also with the nine of pentacles this person is very good with money and got a luxurious rich rich look this person looks very rich and successful because nine of pentacles talks about someone who knows how to dress properly someone who got a very good fashion sense and knows how to walk how to enjoy how to reap their reward knows how to treat themselves or to cook for themselves this person is great at self-loving you know this person help themselves they are self-lover you know this person praise themselves in front of mirror they accept themselves the way they are they got lots of love for themselves this person is an animal lover as well they love animals birds nature fruits this person could be a vegan or they just love mother nature a lot they love flowers and natural things this person doesn't want to wear any makeup or any uh, like they, they don't do anything artificial to their body to their face and this person doesn't pretend to be somebody that they are not that's beautiful with the nine of pentacles this is a real man or real woman that you are dealing with someone who is entering in your life who got the real honest the real honest energy to them okay okay Oh my God, yes, Queen of Pentacles. So with the Queen of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, somehow I'm picking up this person got a huge amount of money and this person is also got, um, you know, inheritance money from their parents, from their grandparents, from other sources. It's like this person got money. This person is rich. Materially, they are successful. Extremely rich at their young age. This person is a rich, spoiled kid. Um, okay, but this person is not, not prideful. I'm picking up someone who is actually down to earth with the nine of pentacle, with the nine of pentacle and queen of pentacle, someone who's down to earth, someone who knows the value of money. Okay. Even this person is really, um, this person really, um, my God, getting lots of gift or like inheritance money very easily but this person knows that how it's difficult for other people to earn money to get money to get that stability so they are extremely charitable and helper and they can this is somebody my group number two is coming towards you to offer you love that they are going to share their blessings a financial gift to other people they are into charity helping those poor kid poor people you know uh, this person is into like you know a non-profitable organization helping animals giving home to the homeless people food to them hungry people or animal they are extremely nurturing mothering loving you know queen of pentacle is the minor and like minor in minor arcana this is the empress card so yeah that's a vibe um giver provider uh, mother this person you know have the energy like i will provide for you i'll give you come to my arms like god really help people through your person that's beautiful also with the queen of pentacles and nine of pentacles this is somebody who's going to give you love offer who is extremely sincere and serious and responsible with their love offer they're not joking they're not kidding um and this person is hella serious because you're manifesting somebody like them and to tell the truth this person financially they are well off extremely stable extremely stable yes you are not going to worry about your finances whether you are a man or woman watching for your wife or husband doesn't even matter this person is going to be rich and wow stable and high priestess wow this person could be a psychic intuitive person a good person with studies okay they got higher learning occult studies uh, they could be teacher professor or preacher 
uh, they were into professor like they really help other people they teach other people this person could be a discoverer scientist uh, into spirituality or into learning into reading books or this person could be an author that they write books or and a high priestess this person got lots of knowledge and somehow i'm picking up with these three cards this person is somebody who doesn't like to speak that much so their love language is going to be physical love they love to give you gift they love to cook food for you this person loves to give you gift as the way that they love you or they're going to give you something very important um to them and they're going to give you that thing to you and someone picking up they don't they don't like to communicate um okay <laughs> they don't like to talk that much this person is an introvert or they are they could be a shy type person or they have their own territory they have their own bubble that they love to stay with the high priestess card this person got a high iq level and they're like i know what i'm doing so don't judge me <laughs> oh my god and with the high priestess card again i'm picking up something has happened in their life that really changed them and that really made them understand that money is something that is good that that really helped you to that is really help you to live your beautiful life in this earthly realm but when it comes to heart love you can't you can't buy love with money you can't it's impossible because love is something that is destiny that is luck love and luck almost same <laughs> not all the rich people are lucky with love okay so love is like a magic to your person so uh, let's take one card to understand that when will you meet your person whatever hint spirits want you to know when you're going to meet this person the sun oh wow it could be month of august or this sun card also talks about it's going to be a sunny day you're really enjoying your day out outdoor outdoor in the garden could be a picnic spot a bar a warm like warm cozy out there it could be a crowded place where sun is there in the sky and you're enjoying the sunlight you're going to meet them outdoor outdoor it could be a garden a party picnic going out celebration having fun because sanka talks about happiness okay could be park because um yeah amusement park or enjoyment where people usually go for enjoyment and happiness um this is how you guys will meet and when the sun definitely okay let's um okay so my group number uh two you know what your sun sign is okay so whatever your sunshine is maybe that is exactly going to be the zodiac month uh of your um person because my sunshine is because my sunshine is pisces so if i choose group number 2 i could meet this person in the month of march or the pisces season this is what i'm picking up that when you're going to meet this person it's going to be warmer warmer energy warmer vibe okay So let's go find out my group number two. Some of the personality of this person, whoever they are. Okay, your person's personality. My group number two. So you got the Knight of Wands, someone who is a quick decision maker. So when it comes to your future spouse, you will find out, or this person who is coming to offer you love, this person will be. like if they want you they will want just like go get her look at look at how the cat is looking at you <laughs> it's like oh my god this person is going to be mesmerized by your beauty by your presence by your existence and oh my god a person like you my group number 2 still exist in this world so they want you they want to have you and they will do anything to get your number or to get close to you this person is though they don't like to talk that much in their career or in everyday life but this person is going to be talkative to you you are the hand man this person is somebody that have to look at the world differently they always got a different point of view they wants to see everything in a different way in a more updated way and this person is not 
a follower this is a leader okay they are the creator that i'm picking up and this person can wait for the perfect divine timing they are not really into hurry or they're not impulsive and ten of wands extremely sincere and responsible and this is gonna be a very busy person my group number two this person is very busy with their work or whatever they're doing but this person always got time for you and that's their vibe that's their energy like though i'm very much busy but i always got time for my partner i have always got time uh, to show my partner that how much i love them so let's go find out that how your person will treat you how this person will treat you my group number two how this person is going to treat you my group number two how this person is going to treat you so okay with the ego card devil card illusion dependency and materialism well my darling this person first tried to test you this is the vibe i'm picking up because whenever i get the devil card it's kind of like devil always okay okay yeah let me tell you what i'm picking up you know what devilish energy it's always like try to predict other people and try to know what other people are doing like the devil energy devils are always one step farther one step ahead to other people but when it comes to you my group number two your person can't predict your a next step they just can't read you they just can't have the idea that whatever person you are and with you your person will understand that money can't buy you money can't buy you because you're not here with them for money you're like if your person is not available to you emotionally you're, you're going to leave them you're going to leave them so you are truly a valuable treasure that i'm picking up and your person will also treat you like a bird and maybe at the initial stage this person will try to cage you and this person will show their red flags my group number two maybe they're going to show you that they are egoist and they are overprotective and this person will try to put some limitations just to check that what type of person you are because you know your person is going to trigger you in some way so that you can show your true self you because you're this person just knows how to see the real person um because your person is somebody who is into business and they know that financial uh like giving and taking financially or the financial um investment can really show you what type of person other people are or what type of people out there but with you your person will try to use the same technique as business but that will not work on you you're like okay 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 wait we are here not for business we are here for love relationship a sacrifice commitment where you do things for your partner okay it's something coming from your heart not from your brain not from your mind so yes definitely how your person will treat you first they will try to make you obsessed with them because this is what your person does in their business world this person is extremely manipulative though then they don't talk that much but this person knows how to play their game to get anybody obsessed with them but it is backfiring them my group number two your person will try to make you obsessed with them but this is backfiring them this person is getting more obsessed with you like oh my god this person is trying to cage you but now it's like you're turning the game upside down now you are caging them or you are controlling them you are taming them <laughs> that's cute yes the wheel oh my god i told you the wheel of fortune luck progress change okay so back to back major arcana and i love the fact that your person is really starting to treat you like 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 everybody else like the way everybody are okay you give them money gift and everything they are always in love with you and you stop giving them money they don't love you anymore they don't reply your text this is how your person um had the experiences so like your person okay okay my group number two you know what your person is going to judge you too quickly and this person got no idea that you are not like others and others in the sense that you're not like others in your person's experience 
okay whoever in your person's experience but with the wheel you are turning the wheel on your favor and you are doing your own stuff you're going to show your person that why you are here in this earth and you got different kind of uh, life and luck and you don't see anything like business business is business but when love there is love love is not a business okay so your person is going to treat you like a lady luck or the man luck whoever you are watching for you're watching for your wife or husband this person is going to treat you like their lucky charm and they're going to treat you like you have changed my life you have changed me and you are the reason that i am restoring my faith in humanity again eight of fire speed activity multitasking definitely with the eight of fire your person they will treat you like you're the beauty queen or the beauty king yes my group number two you are beautiful you are pretty you look amazing and according to your person there's nobody like you okay because definitely with the art and with the aid of fire your person have traveled they have traveled many places but they have never ever seen somebody like you that's so cute okay that's so cute so what else is here in this relationship okay now with the memories card it's kind of give me the energy like you are helping your person to get rid of the bad memories and you guys are going to create the new memories with each other and look at that the card jump the love love is here my group number two you are going to teach your person what true love is what love is what emotion is and you need to love you need to understand you need to keep me in your heart not in your mind okay uh, because mind deals with business but heart deals with emotions and emotions are never uh, wrong okay when your heart is telling you something when your intuition is telling you something it's never wrong so love and memories are also lovely memories okay that's why i'm picking up you and your person both of you are going to make lots of lovely memories together lots of things together uh, that's here like co-creating every day okay tip number two that's a good choice i'm picking up your person is going to change their mind in love after meeting you okay beautiful so my darling if you like this video give it a thumbs up also my darling subscribe to my channel hit the bell icon so that you can come into my family and it gets a lot easier for me to pick up your energy till then stay blessed and happy see you next time i love you so much my darling my amazing group number three welcome welcome true magical reading so you choose this beautiful card a beautiful couple look at that look at that so this is you and your person okay so oh wow so met your soul met is already with you in spirit believe this and they will manifest physically wow <laughs> yes my group number three we're in a soul met journey so who's coming towards you to offer you love offer it's your soul met that you have been manifesting for a long time they're entering in your life they're also manifesting you my darling and this person is already with you in 5D, in your dreams. You already have the idea that what type of person they are. And they will manifest physically very soon. Because you got this card. So believe this and this person will manifest quite soon in your life, my group number three. If you're single and watching this video, new love or new love, baby, let me tell you one thing. You are about to meet them quite recently. Okay, you're about to meet them very, very, very much recently. So... Let's go find out who's coming towards you to offer you love, okay? New love, who's coming towards you to offer you love? Pile number three, who's coming towards you to offer you love? Who's coming towards you to offer you love? I'm going to pick three cards for you, my darling. So who's coming towards you to offer you love? the sun oh my god the positive the most positive card in the tarot deck the sun a leo okay a leo is coming even i saw the beautiful yellow and red combinations it talks your fire energy so you this person could be fire sign aries leo sag so this person is positive sunny happy um courageous optimistic somebody who is out there doing something in online social media or they are famous with the sun you know when the sun is out there nobody nobody can deny that your person exists okay because everybody cannot just deny that the sun is out there 
<laughs> so son, you personally somebody, everybody notice them, everybody turn their head to look at them. Your person could be famous person, they're famous in their career, whatever their career is. Look, when I say famous, doesn't necessarily they need to be a celebrity or they're like acting modeling or something yeah they could be an actor model singer into entertainment society but this person could be like doing their own business doing their own work and they are skillful and they're famous for it okay with the sun cut somebody who is famous somebody who got large popularity like in the neighborhood in the work area or in the people love them people follow them okay and with the sun card i'm picking up but this person is someone they are traditional with the sun energy talks about tradition so when they will offer you this love connection this person will try to talk with your family and talk with your mommy daddy your brother sister your friends whoever you consider whoever you consider them as family so yeah this person will try to interact with your family okay and with the two of pentacle, okay, who's coming towards you to give you offer? Somebody who got double source of income or multi-source of income. This person is multitasker. They're doing lots of things together, different kind of business, different kind of work. They are a freelancer. They're always juggling between two things, always juggling money. This person could be into gambling, stock marketing, bitcoins, or online gaming world, or they love or they are into games, okay? Or maybe like, yeah, this is the vibe I'm picking up. Or they, they invest their money and get their money, get their profit. This person could be into real estate because Pinnacle Energy talks about art, land, okay, rent, land, revenue. That's beautiful. This person could be into, um, okay, they love to balance money. This person could be into finances, okay, like, um, they can give advice about the finances, money. This person could be a banker or accountant, chartered accountant, CA. Or this person could be someone that uh, they are into money or juggling money. Like this person just knows where to put the money to get more benefit, okay? And they're extremely balanced in their life. Like physically, mentally, uh, spiritually, materially. They know how to balance their life. Oh my God, they're hardworking, diligent, and extremely stubborn. And they are they have their goal, they, are, they have their um, mindset, and they know where they're going. So with the Eight of Pentacles, this person is all about, okay, they are workaholic, they love their work, and they put lots of effort to get whatever they want to do. This is a self-made person, my group number three okay this is a self-made person nobody helped them to get whatever they are right now they're hard working and they love their work they love their dream they love their passion and this person could be into education study because eight of pentacle talks about you know uh, somebody who is knowledgeable studious love books also eight of pentacle they got some skill this person could be a technical person or into mechanical um, and like machine or technical things science or could be into a surgery like doctor engineer um oh my god this person is literally they're building something they're i'm picking up this machine around them or car around them it's a mechanical and technical person who is extremely smart with computer language this person is like having this artificial intelligence um and um like this person is really working with ai okay this is the vibe i'm picking up my group number three okay with the eight of pentacle and two of pentacle and the sun eight two and nineteen that's beautiful so you can go and look for the angel number eight two one nine and you will get the perfect answer for yourself so group number three i'm also picking up this person is somebody they're extremely loyal and committed because they love their work and you that's it there's nothing else okay your person really focus on their work and you that's beautiful and that's why you're going to love them that oh my god this person really got two things in their hand work and me that's it so when you are supposed to meet this person okay let's go find out that when you probably meet this person let's go find out the hint when will you meet this person six of pentacles wow 
So let's say my darling, when I get the Six of Pentacles, definitely there is some um, middle uh, friend who is going to help you to meet you guys. Okay, there will be like your family, their family, your friend, their friend, some kind of uh, middle term is there who is helping both of you to meet. It could be God, angel, universe situation that is really playing a role so that you guys can meet together. This could be, could be a business meeting or you are learning something or you're getting something you're buying something because six of pentacles talks about trading right you're buying something you're selling something you're getting something you're talking with them you're you're, you're like yeah six of pentacles giving and taking this is how you guys will meet it could be a gift giving ceremony like you're going somewhere you're giving gift and they're giving gift to you or maybe you're giving gift to them this is how you guys will meet so when we'll meet them it's going to be uh like give and take and there will be definitely a third party who is going to help you to meet um so that you guys can meet each other there will be a help okay there will be helpful people in your life my group number three it could be your family their family your friends their friends or just strangers who is going to help you or act like a cupid okay so let's go find out some of the personality of your person whoever is coming to offer you love offer some of their personality let's go find out i'm going to pick three cards for you my group number three so yeah okay five of sword <laughs> well this person is extremely competitive and this person got lots of enemies and competitive and people misunderstood them okay because look at that i'm picking up this person is somehow they really come off as a a selfish person and people just don't understand that what they're why what they're up to and what they're doing this person is private don't share their plan to other people and this person is somebody other people feel they are tricky they're foxy they're yeah the foxy energy is here but like people don't have any idea what your person is doing next and what this person next plan is so this is a person who really uh, carry their secrets to themselves and not going to share everything to other people, whether they are in a group or something. This person always remain uh, by themselves. They're not going to share everything that they know. And group number three, the best part in this relationship, your person is going to include you in their life and tell you every secret that they have in them. So yeah, that's the vibe I'm picking up. That from that you will know that this person is special for you or you are very much important for this person because they just tell you their secret story or their secret plan that they have never ever shared with anybody else uh yes with the three of cups this person feels extremely comfortable with you okay with the three of cups talks about somebody who loves to eat who loves to drink who loves to enjoy and party this person loves to celebrate a lot each and every little moment like birthday anniversary a little a joy little achievements little milestone little little milestone this person just loves to get it okay they just love to um celebrate little things every day and this person loves to uh enjoy each and every moment because your person truly believes Believe that once a moment is gone you can't just you know take that moment back because it's already gone okay so your person really lived the life the fullest and this person is someone they are carefree they don't really think too much about the future definitely they are secure type because they got eight of pentacle and two of pentacle and they really work for their secure future that's why they are not, they're going to have a very carefree mind for their future because they've already secured money stability and happiness for the future so they are not going to um you know um like uh, ruin their present moment okay because they're already securing their future uh, yeah with the death card this person is extremely transformative and um let's say this person have to change themselves a lot this person got a phoenix quality because with the death energy this person is going to be a jealous type this person get jealous very easily this person get possessive very easily this person can't share you with anybody else like i told you my darling with the fire sword and the death you know this person have the idea like this is mine i know how to keep it i know how to do it so if you're important for them your person is not going to share you with anybody else Else. your person is not going to let anybody else get you what they are having from you so they are going to be jealous like this person gets jealous very easily so this is an issue or this, this can create some problems in you guys so you need to 
tell this person that you are for them you are for them you are not going to leave them this person got trust issues let me tell you from the first day this person got trust issues this person really you know can't trust people that easily so when they trust you they trust with their full heart so it's your responsibility my group number three to make sure that this person doesn't get jealous over you because definitely with the death card this person needs real reason to get jealous so don't make them jealous do not this person get crazy when they're jealous but if you tell them truly that what you're up to and what you feel this person will understand you because this person truly trusts you okay so uh let me get one more card about their personality my beautiful group number three yes the five of cups this person really extremely emotional type okay i told you you know this person is somehow they're insecure because they're like you are so beautiful you're so cute what if i can't um work hard to keep you in my life what if so you just met somebody more 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 better more more powerful than me and you just leave me then what will happen to me but my darling with the five of cups you need to tell your person that no matter what i'm not going to leave you this person is someone who is extremely emotionally connected to you my group number um three so let's go find out how this person will uh, treat you darling okay how will this person treat you let me get three cards for you how this person will treat you so Seven of Swords, definitely, my darling, this person can't keep any secrets from you. And this person is going to be protective of you as well. Let me get one clarification of the Seven of Swords because Seven of Swords talks about deception also. Uh, yeah, Three of Cups, yes. My darling, your person is going to include you in their close group, okay? And they are really going to protect you as well. I'm picking up the page of air. This person is going to be truthful and analytical to you. This person will tell you everything, whatever they feel about you. They're not going to go round and round to hide their feelings. This person is not going to hide their feelings at all. No. Yes, Ten of Fire. This person is somebody who is an overworker. Or they are going to do lots of things for you. And this person can really do so much things for you that sometimes this person gets stressed or um, like... They're like burned or burning their energy. So don't let them work too hard, my group number three, because this person is overly devoted to you that they can do anything for you. They're not going to say no to you. So now it's your responsibility to uh, look that, uh, look after that. If this person is really working too hard or not, or what, or how was their day? Just ask them because this person is really putting everything for you and they're extremely truthful to you honest with you they love you and they love you they will never ever ever cheat on you this person is not a cheater so you got the mystery so in your relationship there is you know the mysterious energy talks about your person will always have the curiosity to know more about you because you just have this mysterious energy around yourself and your person is love you and they see the future with you. That's the vibe. Your person sees the future with you because your person, I told you, they're not going to invest in anything that has no future with them. And your person can see the future with you. They can see that, oh my God, it's going to be amazing life to solve the mystery that you have, my group number three, in yourself. And your person loves it your person loves it and they can see the future with you my group number three so that's all i got for you i hope you enjoyed this reading give it a thumbs up also my darling subscribe to my chahita bell icon come into my beautiful family so that it get a lot easier for me to pick up your energy because now you're my family member i love you guys so till then stay happy and blessed Mwah.